We finished them off. I finished them off. Huh? Our future. It looks like this is Ospio. It's so gloomy and damp here. It's giving me the chills, too. It's because the city is in a cavern. I wonder if the lack of sun drives the people here to do shady things, like stealing Blastia cores.
You know, Yuri, your attitude, your behavior, they don't seem very nightly. Where'd that come from? I mean, we're entering the city through a back entrance, like thieves. This coming from the guy who picked the lock. I'm just tagging along to find Flynn, and now you've turned me into a thief. We haven't stolen anything. Sheesh. This city sure has a lot of books. I'm not really too crazy about reading, and I have a hard time sleeping in this place. Yeah, you seem like you're too jittery to sit still and look at something for too long. You're one to talk. Hey, what happened to Estelle? She's been over there reading books ever since we got here. Hmm. Estelle, time to get going. Hmm. Once she starts reading, you can't pull her away. Huh? Did you say something? This seems to be literature from an ancient civilization. She's not even listening. Keep out. Seriously. Mordio. I guess this is the place. I think people usually try knocking first. Looks like no one's home. What should we do? No point in hesitating when you're heading into a den of thieves. No, I don't want us to commit any more crimes. I guess that means it's my turn, then! What? Your turn? We shouldn't do that, either! Nothing to it! Wait for me! Please, wait! <sighs> Why does he always do that? place like this you can pretty much live anywhere you can eat and sleep if you set your mind to it Yuri don't you have something to say first uh hello we're coming in and the door 
Carol here, open your door. Sorry about that. Honestly, Yuri. Excuse us. Is anyone home? It's a good thing no one's here. That means we get to look for evidence. <laughs> <laughs>